Hello, 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 welcome back to the derpiest prison known to man. Oh yeah, so there's been a couple changes. As you can see, I actually removed all the trees. My storage room is a little full. Um, but I also built a fence all the way around. All that good stuff. Now, we should probably do some more planning. Um, yeah, probably. Not really very efficient. <laughs> overall sorry guys I'm still a little sick all that kind of stuff but you can see here I've built a few more offices I kind of adjusted that a little bit made a few changes there the warden is still kicking butt let's go into here and look at a few things uh, grants so this one's pretty nice I don't think we can get that right now uh, administration center build two offices hire a warden Unlock finance through bureaucracy and hire an accountant. We're almost there. We're like half done that one. Okay, that's good. Um, yeah, you know what? Let's just do that one for now. Let's go into bureaucracy, which is up top here. And hit it. And we need finance. Boom, 500 bucks. It's going to take about six hours. Okay, not too, too bad. We can speed up through that quite easily. I figure if I need more offices, I can always add them as we go along. And I was thinking of having maybe like a little staff room back behind here. But we'll see. We'll see how all that goes. Uh, I, I switched this as well to a two-wide entrance instead of a single. Uh, just because I realized that this is basically 120 by 120. Uh, so you kind of need a two wide just to keep symmetry and balance and all that kind of stuff. So, what's next? What's next? What's next? Oh god, there's so much that we need to do. Uh, we have our power station. Again, I adjusted the fence around that to connect in through the storage room as its only entrance. I think that's a smart choice. I could probably just get rid of this fence and expand it out you know what maybe we should do that right now yeah we'll do that and then we'll go with a fence like so down to there yeah that works good and then some gravel just along there spending all my money um, I've been selling a bit of wood let's let's get going a little bit here I've been spending a little bit of uh, selling a little bit of the wood that I've harvested up, just because um, I had it, so I figured, why the heck not, right? Okay, good. Those guys are doing their little bit of work. We're dismantling the fence, putting in gravel, all that kind of stuff. All is going well. Okay, so I guess, actually, you know what? I don't really need the fence there. If I'm going to do a staff room back here, it's going to incorporate that fence in. Let's do a little bit of planning here. Uh, how big does a staff room need to be? What is a staff room? Where is the staff room? Uh, visitation, common room. Why don't I see a staff room? Shower yard. Am I missing something here? Infirmary, visitation, laundry, morgue. It's not a morgue. Staff room. Okay. Minimum size, 4x4. Four four. Requires a wide sofa and a drink machine. It must be indoors. Okay. Let's do that. Let's just build. So it has to be minimum 4x4. Four four. So let's do this. Yeah. Uh, maybe like that. Let's do like that. Okay, we'll get a staff room going here. Uh, we need a door right there, just like so. That should get that going. Those guys will start building that. Okay, good. That should give us... Let's look at our grants here again. So, the staff well-being... Hmm, five guards without assigned duties... I don't have any guards. Okay, well, we can't do that yet. It's okay, though. We're, we're developing, guys. We're getting things going. So we're kind of going to have, like, this staff maintenance area up here. 
right? So I kind of want to designate this as kind of like a little staff area, right? So I'm just going to set that as a plan. Uh, as so we could do like an infirmary and morgue and laundry and all that kind of stuff a little bit further up as you can see there's lots of different rooms that we require different things for so aha okay um, I want to change this to concrete wall though like so uh, we need walls and walls good that'll segregate that off then this will become a staff room. Boom. And boom. Staff room. Okay. Now what do we need? We need a wide sofa and a drink machine. Wide sofa. $300. No big deal. Drink machine. Oh god, that's expensive. Boom. Okay. Good. Staff room should be done. Right? We're about 50 some odd percent the way through the finance, so that's good. We can hire our accountant soon. And all of this is kind of stuck together. So we have all of our staff in a little area. I think that's going to be pretty good. Uh, that leaves us quite a bit of room. I mean, this is a pretty big map uh, based on what I can tell. So maybe what we should do is a little bit more planning. I definitely want to extend this fence out and make this uniform. Um, we could probably even put it with some concrete walls around it over time here. Uh, but we'll see how that goes. Okay, Our storage room is pretty full with logs. I don't know if these have any use. Do they have a use, guys, or should I just sell them? Ooh, 15. That's nice. That's a nice stack. Okay, that's good. That's good. I th I th I'm liking this, guys. I'm liking this. Why is that a different material? Anyways, I don't want to know. I don't want to know, guys. Uh, researching finance. Okay, good. Warden, about time you did something. Alright, so things are going pretty well, I think. If we do something down here... You know what? Let's just pause it. Now that we have our staff room... Uh, let's just give it a quick pause, okay? I want to just look things over. So we have our double jail entrance here and all that kind of stuff to get into the prison, right? Now, if we do a little bit of planning, so say this is all a wall, this is a wall, okay? It's a little bit less open than what we were originally thinking. Um... That should work pretty well. Kind of like a nice little big long alleyway, right? Uh, no, you know what? No, I don't like that. Let's do a little... So, if we do like a wall like this... And you know what? Better yet, let's come down. Make it a little bit bigger. Okay. And then we could set up... <coughs> We could set up like a little back hallway here. Something like that. That might be pretty good. And then down here could be like a visitation, right? Something like that. I don't know how big we need. Um, we can do something like this with... I don't know. Maybe like this. Because I think it requires 3x3. Three visitation where is that why can't I see things visitation yeah so there's not really much of a requirement so we could probably get away with something like this uh, just pretty simple nothing too crazy uh, we could probably go as far down as there yeah yeah and not you Okay, so that'll be the corner wall. Okay, and then we could set up a little system back here. And then maybe that's like our doorway in for the prisoners. And then we have another door that they have to go through. Right, so this will be where the people come in. And then this will be the prisoners. Like so. Maybe something a little bit like that. Right, and that gives you a few little visitation areas. 
Okay, I think that's pretty solid. I think that's a good idea. I don't know. And we got like this kind of built-in hallway a little bit, which is kind of nice as well. Um, I kind of like having this a little bit separated out. So maybe... Maybe we can put a staff door here. Like a double staff door. I don't know if that's a good idea or not. Or maybe we just do this. Right? So then we have the staff door to get into the offices and stuff. And this is the intake and the prisoners go this way. That might work. I kind of like that. We could potentially... I might change all this around still. These are kind of... I mean, fancy office, right? But not really necessary. I think that's a pretty good idea. Now, we don't go all the way to the edge here. And I don't know if that's not... I don't think that's a bad idea. Because... I mean, essentially, it gives you a double protection barrier type thing, right? So, let's kind of just plan out a little bit more here. Okay, let's see what that gives us. So we have about 11 wide. Uh, we'll keep our little hallway going for the prisoners. And we'll keep this sectioned off. Maybe we can even expand on this a little bit. So we have the office down here. We could have another entrance out this way as well. Actually, you know what? Let's do that right now. Another staff door right there. Good. That'll be perfect. We'll do that right now. Great idea. Okay. Pretty good. Pretty good. So I'm kind of switching from an outside model, what I was thinking of doing before, into an indoor style prison, which to me made a little bit more sense once I actually thought about it. Uh, and then here, we'll do a double entrance like that for these guys to get out this way. Okay. And then you know what? Just to make things nice and kosher, what about making all of this the same kind of thing, right? Where it's that kind of little bit of a extra setup, right? Just kind of like buffers, you know what I mean? Uh, we'll close that off for right now. Okay. Not too, too bad. Uh, this is 11 wide, so just a simple door like that should do. Uh, now, I'm not sure what I'm putting here yet. It could be like a classroom, it could be something along those lines. Uh, but on the other side here as well, let's see. Hmm. You know what? I'm kind of thinking I should change some things, but we'll see. We'll see how this goes. Uh, so most of this is going to be open. But this is kind of where we start the prisoners down. Now this up here is going to be like a staff door, and maybe we don't even need these, right? Because this is kind of a staff entrance way. Uh, and then what we can do is we can segregate off up here somewhere for another staff entryway to get into the rest of our staff section. Not bad, not bad, right? Alright, let's hit the play button a little bit here. Let's get things going. Let's get that to be removed. Get that staff door in. We have that going. We'll probably need a metal detector at some point here. Because, uh, well, I mean, you don't want these guys having metal and whatnot. All of this will need to become a foundation as well. Like, all of this is a building. So... Yeah, that's a bit of an issue as well. We'll put in a few little objects here of planning. Lots of doors, lots of extra security, all that kind of stuff. I'm not sure what's necessary for visitation. I kind of just penciled something in. Um, so I hope that works. Okay. Not bad. I like it. We're almost done our account. We're getting a little bit of money. We're, we're going to get even more money here shortly. Receive five grand for basically nothing. Uh, what other grants? So the basic detention is the kitchen, the canteen, shower, holding cell, yard, etc., etc., etc. Okay. 
Health and well-being, not too, too bad. Education reform. Staff well-being. That's not too, too bad either. Might take a little bit longer to get some of those. But, there we go. Bureaucracy. Finance. Done. Okay. Staff, we can hire ourselves an accountant. Boom. Just like that. And, let's see what that gives us now. Aha, what are these? Short-term and long-term investment. So, I pay 5000 and I get 16000 and you just wait. I'll do that, okay? Pay a little bit, get 16000 in a few 70-some-odd hours. All right, not too, too bad. That accountant, that accountant's got some game. I like it. Um, so yeah, I think for the most part things are going well. What I'm thinking of doing is actually running a fence all the way up to this one. Just to have a little bit of an extra security thing. Um, might not be a bad idea. And then I kind of end all of this a little bit closer. Right, so kind of like that, right? So the buildings would end about here right so that's as far as we can go okay hey I don't think that's half bad uh, obviously we need a pretty big uh, kitchen and whatnot here um, we need a cantina right away and I don't know what else we need I think that's about it really and then of course the jail cells prisoners and all you know so, yeah, I think that's what I'm going to plan next year. I'm going to quickly plan that, and I'll show you guys off camera. Alrighty, so I have a little section here. Uh, I don't know if this is actually required. We can just leave it like that. So, the way I figure it, this could be like a little cleaning cupboard. This is going to be our kitchen right here. Uh, this will be like our full cantina area. And then we'll have, like, metal detectors and whatnot, like so. Uh, we'll have, you know, nice secure doorways, all that kind of stuff. I'm not sure what this can be <coughs> at the moment. Uh, if anybody has any ideas on that. I mean, there's lots of different things. I mean, it could be, it could be the infirmary, right? It could be a classroom. Maybe a classroom right by the kitchen. That might work. Uh, but yeah, so I think for the most part, we're on a little bit of a better path here. Uh, we obviously need to get in an infirmary. Uh, I'm probably going to expand this power station to meet these dimensions. I might have to move it down the road, or maybe right away. We'll see how that all goes. Uh, but for the most part, that's looking pretty good in my opinion. Um, I wonder, we probably don't need this one either. Yeah, probably not. Again, I don't have a spot for this. Uh, this is going to be another channel way. I figure, like, if I can get some high security people down there or something like that, that might work well. And then I guess we need a yard or two and the infirmary and all that kind of stuff so let's see if we go over here and we make this what if we make this another aisle way like so we could have a back staff door entrance as well um, so that would be like a staff door or something like that and up here we could do like a little infirmary setup so how much is that Infirmary, just enough for bed and whatnot, okay? Let's get back to the planning. Dang, we got a decent amount of... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven? Yeah. That should work. We'll go seven and seven. That should be okay, I think. And then what we can do is we can have like a little four by four. Wait, that's four by three, isn't it? Maybe like a 4x4 four four office off the side. You know what? Let's do that, but have two 4x4 four four offices. Yeah, that's that's a good idea. 
Okay, so this will be one, two, three, four. So that'll come up. So there's one four by four office. One, two, three, four, F five. And there's another four by four office. Like so, and that can be our infirmary there. So things like uh, the psychologist, right? If you look at the staff, uh, look at the bureaucracy, I mean, right? So there's, uh, you know, health, psychology, stuff like that. I'm sure we'll need other stuff as well. The other thing that we might need is like an armory. Maybe the armory could be like right here. It seems... It seems a little uh, low tech, though, doesn't it? What about an armory up in this neck of the woods? We got a four-wide entryway, uh, so we could do like some sort of a nice, high-security entrance thing here, where it's like jail cell, metal detector, double jail cell type thing, into what is an armory back here. I don't know. Might be a good idea. Might work out. Uh, we probably could even just move that to here, right? Hmm, this is quite a bit of room for just that. Maybe it'll be somewhere else. Maybe it'll be down here. I don't know. Maybe it will be right here. That's a tough question. That is a tough question right there. But I think we're getting a little bit more planning done and stuff like that. I think that things are going a little bit clearer. I hope. Oh, you know what we can do? Let's see. That's three. That's three. Ooh. How about right here? Yeah. Yeah. This right here can be our armory right at the end there that'll work good nice little double jail <coughs> behind a staff door as well that should work out nicely and then we can kind of designate something for here I don't know if there's anything like an Alcoholics Anonymous or you know stuff like that but uh, we can set up some room maybe execution you never know uh, yeah, so this will be like morgue, infirmary, psychologist section. We got our kitchen. We got our cantina. I think at this point now we kind of just need our holding cells. Uh, what else do we need for this thing? Holding cell. Uh, yard. And then just some guards and whatnot. So... I'm going to plan out between this and next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching, first and foremost. I know we didn't do a ton, but kind of a little bit more planning involved, um, which is probably a good thing. Um, so I think between this and next episode, I'm going to plan out my jail cells, how I want them. And then from there, we can, uh, we can start doing some construction and some gameplay, get some prisoners up in this thing. So thanks again for watching, everybody. Have yourselves a great day, and I'll catch you next time. Bye-bye for now.